What's that? I will say thank you, God, who made me to be here. First and foremost, I have a friend in Nigeria. I'm a Nigerian. My name is Basil Opalokitugu from Nigeria. So I have a friend in Nigeria that has the same problem with me, which came here. And when I saw him coming back to Nigeria, it was very fine. The two legs were very fine. It was a cross leg. But when he came back, I admired my eyes. I said, wow, so this can be done. So I started the plan to come for my own new surgery. Then I made a contact to India. And I made a contact to Mr. Kunel. He asked me, yes, you know Fortis Hospital, that he can lead me to it if I can be able to come. Then we started planning. I have to go to the embassy of um, India in Lagos and get my visa. After getting my visa, then I connected with Akanel again, which directed me that if I can get a, a flight very soon before Christmas, it will be better. Then from the embassy, I asked them, how do I get plane to India? They told me that they have a special flight coming to India from Nigeria, which left, left Nigeria on the 13th of uh, December to be back in Nigeria again on the 6th of uh, December. So I made plan, asking this operation would be falling into that three, uh, 13 days. Can I be free to come back to Nigeria? I asked Mr. Kanel. He said, yes, it's possible. So I paid the ticket going and coming. Getting here, there was a drug and I took in Nigeria that made it impossible for them to do operation on Monday, last Monday, which is for tent. That drug is a drug that if there is, if there is a, a surgery, if they perform surgery, there may be a problem of blood not cutting. So I have to postpone it for another one week. So that is why I'm here. And by the time I came to India, Mr. Kanel already on the airport, telling me to come out from gate 3, which I did. I came out from the gate 3, I met him there. He took me straight to the guest room where he prepared for me. From there, I washed myself, then come back to him, to Taizi, to this Fortis hospital, straight to Dr. Arora which we are connected from Nigeria to his office. He's a wonderful man. When he see me, he smiles. He look at me, say it will be over. We can handle it. And then the other doctor that came in is like Kira. 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 They are fantastic people. They are wonderful. God has sent them to India to make people good. They are very wonderful people. And then when I met them, and then they said the operation, I mean, surgery will not happen on 14th, that it will happen on 21st. I said, okay, I go back to my guest room. On 21st, I came. When I came on 21st, I was admitted on the 28th being Sunday. 21st, I was taken away to the theater room, and the surgery was performed. And uh, in fact, it is a miracle because I couldn't believe that within the space of three days, I will be working efficiently. Look at me now. Only I have a terrible pain on the night of uh, 31st, I mean uh, 21st. That day the profession was performed. There is a plenty, uh, what do you call it, pains. pains. But the next morning, when the doctors come arrive, uh, arrive the print, uh, medicines, everything went well. Stabilized me and look at me now. Since then, the free therapists are coming and they seem that I'm doing well. Even the one that left here now said that I'm okay. So I'm quite happy with the 40th hospital. The management are okay, good. All the staff, 
very small, immediately you ring bell, they will, three or two or three of them will be here asking me what, what, yes, I will tell them. So, and they perform. So, in fact, everybody is happy. I myself very happy. Already I have contacted my people in the Nigeria, telling them everything about this <laughs> hospital. I video it here, I video the down, sent to them. And then they said, wow, it's a very good something. It's God doing. So I'm very happy for you people. And I believe myself getting back to Nigeria, more people will be coming to this hospital. I believe so. All right.